What is going on everybody? My name is Cody or Crazy Amazing and today we are back on Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War and today I have a multiplayer for you guys. Normally I do zombies but today um, you guys can see I am prestiged and I'm level 11 so um, I'm pretty far up there. If we go over to my, where is it at, progression? No. Here we go, combat record. If we come over to combat record, we can see I almost have 7 hours played, and my KD is 1.22, so, you know, I'm a pretty decent player. And I'm going to be showing you guys exactly how I got to this high of a level and the best classes. I'm only going to be showing you guys two but these are the best classes that personally I can run. I do not run the MP5. If you guys are here uh, for MP5 class, then um, go fuck yourself. So before I get started, though, I just want to say that if you guys could hit that subscribe button and like the video, that would mean a whole heck of a lot. And um, I'll be doing all types of Cold War videos. I might be doing some new different stuff, but mainly Cold War. So if you guys like Cold War, hit that subscribe button. There's going to be plenty of more. So getting started, the first class you guys are going to want to make is an XM4 class. This gun you get, I'm pretty sure it's the very first assault rifle you unlock, and it's actually surprisingly good. So the perks that I run are Flat Jacket, Scavenger, and Ghost. So basically, the um, any score streaks can't see me. Um, I can get ammo off the ground, and flat jacket, I take less damage from explosives. And once you guys get high enough level, you guys are going to want to put gunfighter on your wild card. That way, so you can get an extra three attachment slots, and it just makes your gun a whole heck of a lot better. So personally, I like to use this scope right here, the uh, ARMS 3X because I like to have a little bit of a range and it's up to you guys you guys can use any of these scopes whatever one you personally like but that's just a scope I rock coming down to muzzles I use the very first one because I care about the re recoil because I'm shooting pretty far away so I just need the recoil to be as stable as possible um, coming down to the barrel I use the 13.5 inch uh reinforced heavy and this gives me a 100 percent effective damage range and a 40 percent bullet velocity increase it does take your aim walking movement speed down but we don't really care about that now for the body i use the steady aim laser because i like the hip fire accuracy i am well aware that you can use this uh <clears throat> the target whatever um honestly i think it would be better to run but I just like having the um, the extra hip fire accuracy because there are a lot of situations on smaller maps where it you don't have time to look down your sight. But if you're someone that is a uh, really has a good reflex time and you know can do that, I would definitely recommend not running that. But something I can recommend is running this grip right here. I don't know why all these have super complicated names, but using uh, the second grip is. In my opinion the best one because it honestly helps you with a little bit of everything um if you use the foregrip it helps you with the vertical or ho sorry horizontal uh recoil but i like a little bit of help on everything because if we come down here we can see that i use the 40 round speed mag which you know it helps with so many things um you go through the you know it's a fully automatic rifle so you go through ammo like crazy so you do take a big big hit in ads but i mean look at that it goes up at least 25 percent in four categories so it's what i just like to run and i run the field tape because i like to flinch resistance it's 90 percent and i use um the wire stock for the extra sprint to fire time so i run the gallows my secondary but i never ever ever had to pull it out it's just in case i feel like being extra toxic and for the tactical, always run the stun. If you don't have the stun, use a, use a flashbang. I said that backwards, but I don't know why I don't use a flashbang there. And you guys can use whatever you want for your lethal and field upgrade. I use the same turret because I uh, hate getting murked by uh, attack helicopters. And for the second class, which is my personal favorite that I'm trying to get gold right now, 
is the M16. Now for this class, what you guys are going to want to have on again is Gunfighter because I just like the extra slots. I mean, you can make your primary weapon, which is your first line of defense, better. So why would you not do that? Uh, I run Flak Jacket, Assassin, and Gunho because um, I like the uh, extra sprint time because it's not fully automatic, you know. It's not about... It, you just need to hit your shots, basically. Uh, I run a flashbang, a C4, and the Sam turret. You'll see that pretty much in all my classes. And on the secondary, I use this uh, burst uh, pistol. I just, I don't know. It's just because I don't want to be used to shooting a burst assault rifle and then have to go into a um, fully automatic pistol because I feel like I would, like, you know, tap fire like I would with the M16. So that's just what I do. You guys can do what you want. But coming to the optic, you will see that I use um, the millistop reflex. I've been experimenting with it, but I'm going to go back to the uh, same one I use on my MX4 because, like I said, I like being able to shoot farther. The muzzle, I use the uh, very first one you get for the recoil. And I use the 15.9-inch strike team uh, barrel because I like the extra damage and the extra fire rate. This is very very important if as soon as you get this use that uh the body i use the steady aim laser under barrel i use the this grip right here because i'm like i said it hits every category and there is no bad side of that grip i use the 45 round mag because i like the little bit of extra uh you could use this one which is actually hits a little bit more categories but you do lose ads time and for a burst you need that so that's why i don't use that I use the speed tape because it helps with aim down sight speed and I use the wire st stock because the sprint to fire time is a lot better. And if you guys are trying to get gold, um, you guys can see what I have done. Not a lot, not a lot, but it, uh, it definitely takes time, but you know, I kind of want dark matter. If you guys use these classes and there's anything you think that could be improved, uh, comment down below. I'll try it out, and if I agree with you, I will put it in the comments as well. I'll pin it and like your comment. That way, so other people know to uh, change their class a little bit if they try this one. But yeah, guys, I uh, love you all. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next video. Peace out, boys.